Hello world, what's up guys? It's Ryan here, making another video for Build It with Ryan. Today, I'm going to show you some specialized buildings that I got from the last design challenge, blueprint exchange. So the first one I want you to see is, I already have this one, the Buckingham Palace. I already placed it in my capital city, over here. So this is how the Buckingham Palace is looking and this is actually a pretty good building. This is actually a pretty good building because it gives a 40% population boost on landmarks. Okay, and then now I'm gonna travel to my Frosty Fjord to show you the other two buildings that I got from the design challenge. So I actually didn't get the other two because I already have them. So. I'm just gonna show you what they look like. So the other building is this you made Hawan Palace. So this palace is actually okay. I mean it has a cool look, but the population boost is only 20%. So compared to the Buckingham Palace, this is just okay, I guess. An okay population boost building. Or I should say it's not okay because it's 20% is really low. Okay, so the last thing that I can I'm gonna buy is this Alhambra. I think this building is in Israel in the real world, and it looks seems like it's really really old. Um, is was originally built in a 89 CE, so this building is like 1200 years old. Actually, no, CE is actually never mind, it, it's just a really old building. So, I got 3840 blueprints, and it cost me 2000 blueprints to get this building. So, I'm definitely gonna buy it, and then we're gonna take a look of how it looks like. So this is a 65% population boost building for landmarks, which is great. 65% is a lot. So let me build it, take a look at what it looks like. Wow, that actually is amazing. This is an impressive building. Look how cool this is. Just wow, it is so pretty with the tree around it and um, this ancient building look like and the people walking around it it is absolutely beautiful so i'm glad that i got this building and i'm sure that i can use it in a lot of design challenge so this is great i have to place it in one of my city i think because of its high population boost okay so let's see what else i got let me actually show you um, the 2022 New Year building that I got from the New Year event, I did uh, all my um, uh, mayor chat. Oh shoot, I forgot to do this one. This one expired. I on the last uh, week I did all my um, assignments and then I used all my 15 uh, go tickets to get as many points as possible and also upgrade tons of buildings to get to this point and right now I'm playing in the uh, Metropolis League so let me show you this building actually it's really cool too it is I think this is the first beach building for the new year building and it got 2022 on both sides and it's like a little bit of a, a little a, a tropical uh, beach building with a little pool inside overall it's amazing with the firework on it it's just really really great building um, so I'm also really happy that I got this building too okay but the last thing I'm gonna show you what I'm gonna use for my last little bit of the um, blueprint I still have 1840 blueprint I'm not gonna get this two palace building uh, which I already have I would definitely get the sim cash so 200 blueprint for 50 sim cash I would get it 250 blueprint for 100 sim cash. I will get it. I will get all the sim cash anytime. So another 200 sim cash, and I still have 1,000 blueprint left. Let me see what I would like to get. Maybe I will get. I kind of want to get some uh, area expansion items. 
or the uh, city storage item. Maybe I can get both. Let me see. 150 for the area expansion items and 400. So it only cost me 650. I will still have 300 left. Maybe I will just get the gold key. I kind of want to get the platinum keys as well, only because it's it's the most expensive. It's gonna cost 600. Maybe I'll do this. I'm gonna get the platinum keys and the area expansion item. I just can't decide. I wish I had a bit more so that I can get the platinum keys, the area expansion items, and the uh, city storage items. So let me see if I can upgrade any uh, map with a city expansion item. I think I should get a city expansion item because I'm getting really close. I think this is my last piece of plan until I unlock the last region. So maybe, let me just do this. I'm gonna go get the uh, city the area expansion items. And then I have 940 left, which I will get the platinum keys. And then I have 300 left, I just get the gold keys. All right, okay. Thank you so much. This is a little bit of update on my SimCity of how I doing it. Um, hope you enjoyed this video. If you haven't subscribed, please subscribe to the channel. Give me a like button. Um, leave me a comment below. And I will see you on my next video. Thank you for watching.